I want to show you how I defeated Marcus and Valerius. It was very epic. He had the bird and he was riding it and he do the pew pew and I was like, no, I had to use Susaki Aqua to do water damage. Water is his weakness, so I had my Suzuki and my Susako Aqua. When he was low on health, then he was almost died. I kill. Uh, eliminated. I'm going to show you the whole fight while I commentate. See, I was shooting the bird. And then I had to reload. My Susako was taking damage. Whenever one of my pals was low on health, I would switch out a new pal. My Susako is good here because he does water damage. Now I should be switching out my pal. Mine is almost dead. Switch out your pal, bro. Why haven't you switched, bro? Switch. Susako almost dead. Oh, no. Is he gonna die, the Susako? No. And I keep shooting the bird in the face. That allows me to do extra damage. Finally, I change out to my super duper Blue Blucy is very good because that Kelpsy is with water spells. And since Marcus and Valeris is fire, it will do more damage. It will be highly effective. So I keep shooting Marcus and Valeris. Puchichi, puchichi. I try to shoot them in the head if it's easy. Otherwise, I just shoot at his body. And my water, my blue sea is doing a lot of damage with the water move. But I'm taking a lot of damage too. I have aggro, not my pal. That's not good. If I run out of health, I will die. If my pal runs out of health, I will just get a new one. Throw out a new one. So my blue sea is doing many water attacks. I go behind the pillar, but I still get hit and stunned. Very strange. Then I notice my blue sea is taking too much damage. I have to change to another one. So I throw out fire sea. Fire sea has fire moves. That's not very good. I'm almost dead here. One more hit and I'm probably dead. Watch out, there is a red uh, zone in the area. Whoa. Now what I want to do here is run away, not take damage. This will regenerate my shield. Instead of being low health, I want to be low health with a fully charged shield. So I let my fire see fight him. The good thing about fire see here, he takes reduced damage from fire attacks, so he can take him a bit longer than other pals. So that's nice. Now my shield is fully recharged. So I can go back with my shotgun, but I have to reload it first. Fire Sea is about to die, so I have to throw out my next pal. My shield is immediately blown up. Damn, bro, that's a lot of damage. Please change to another Kelpsy. Now we have Green Sea. This is not a good choice. Green Sea has grass abilities. That's not so good. It does not do... Wait, Green Sea attack is highly effective? What? But Green Sea has grass abilities. Is it because Green Sea is a water pal? Oh no. Have I been wrong the whole time? I can't believe it. It's not true. Anyway, I'm low on health again. Now my shield is recharging because I haven't taken damage for a while. So my Green Sea is doing like a green laser beam. Whoa. But Green Sea is very hurt. We're gonna have to throw out Traxi. It's a Dragon Kelpsy. It's not a Kelpsy that's wearing drag. It's a Traxi with Dragon abilities. I don't like Traxi because uh, he doesn't seem to use his special moves very often. He keeps doing the crappy single target pew. Use the other pew pew, not just the single target. He bounces on the floor. Why? You should be fighting, not bouncing. While Draxi is out, he will do pew pews with a laser dragon attacks. Bang! Very nice. 
but he does not do much DPS. There I lose all my shield again because the bird flew straight into me. So I have to go out of combat for a while so my shield will recharge. So I'm letting my Draxi take the fight a little bit. Come on Draxi, you have to take it. But now Blucy and Susako Aqua have regenerated health while being on standby. So I can summon Susako Aqua and make him do some damage. He is a water type, which is good against Marcus and Valeris. They are fire. So Susako here, he will start doing some DPS, but he is very hurt already. I have to throw another Kelpsy. I think it is time for Blucy. You see, Blucy has now recovered lots of health from being in standby, like I said earlier. So I'm gonna summon Blucy. Oh, Susako actually died. Why did I let that happen? How was I... How did I let that happen, bro? But now we have Blucy. He is like the DPS dealer. He does the big bubble, the small bubble, and the laser beam. I think he will do the laser beam. No, I had to put him away. He was so hurt. Now we have Fire C again. He does fire moves, which is not so good, but it says highly effective. I don't really understand. If a water type uses fire move against a fire, how is it highly effective? I don't understand the game mechanics. Maybe I need to learn to play. Yeah, that's maybe true. Now I summon Green C. Green C is ready for battle. He's gonna do some pew pews. He does like uh, some grass abilities. He has like tornadoes of the grass and he has a seed mine. And I think he has some sort of laser beam that he rarely managed to ca cast because it has a, he had, has a charging time. Now I have Draxi out again. He's going to do dragon abilities. Pew pew pew. But the boss is now low on health. And my shield has recharged, and I'm also full on health, so I get a bit reckless here. Since I'm almost full on health and everything, I just go in and I defeat the boss. And that made me very happy on this inside. Draxi was also very happy to participate in the kill. Thank you. You're welcome. Good job. Arigato. Cosimos.